My dear brothers and sisters, today we are going to reflect upon the song of Mary, the song of praises. Mary could sing the song of praises amid struggles, difficulties and crises. And she believed there is power in praising and thanking God. When praising and thanking take place, the power of God fills our hearts and minds. Today's uh, gospel we see the beautiful song of Mary which is called as Magnificat, which means Magnificat means magnify, magnifying the glory of God. This song has a background of Jewish and Christian tradition. And this Magnificat is about the narrative of the birth of Jesus. And there are three more songs like the song sung by Zachariah, Benedictus. And then again, we come across a kind of dialogue between uh, uh, Gabriel and Mary, and we call it as Excelsis Dio. Again, there is one more song sung by Simon when uh, he uh, met for the first time Jesus in the temple. And then he, he sang after joy and the Simon's uh, the song of praise is called Nun Dimitis. In all these songs we see the power of God and these songs of praise inspire us to look at God and admit the awesome the admit uh, the power of someone uh, who is awesome. Mary uh, had to struggle or face struggles, especially when she became pregnant while she was betrothed. She had an uncertain future. She had to face a retribution from her own people, but among amidst all these crises and struggles, she focused on God and that is why she was able to sing this song of praise. My dear brothers and sisters, let's also learn to praise and thank God despite of financial crisis, misunderstanding, humiliation, embarrassment we keep our focus on God and then that's how we draw the power of God in our life